Hey everybody, my name is Buddy Blackford and I will be teaching you about Adobe After Effects. I was drinking with Bucky at the bar and we we're doing uh, a bunch of shots and all of a sudden he just asked me to make him some YouTube videos and I was like, hey, why not? Sounds awesome. So here I am. Um, the version of Adobe After Effects I'm using right now is uh, CS6, you can see there and I uh, couldn't figure out how to get that off Jeez. and um, basically this first uh, tutorial is going to be a small introduction um, I'd like to intro introduce you to the workspace and what I like to uh, have my workspace set up and everything like that and then I'll teach you more in a series of tutorials later so starting as the workspace this whole area is called your workspace and um, if you go to uh, to a window you have workspace here and there are different types of workspaces you can create your own and you can have the standard one I like to I created my own and I like to use that one and um, I'll show you different ways to tweak them also so over here on on your left that I have highlighted right here this is the project panel you can import videos pictures folders and your compositions will appear here and then you can also search um, for the different folders with your composition because when you get on larger projects you'll have a lot of stuff in here over here in the middle this is the composition panel this is where any of your video and uh, or pictures will show up and then you can see how the effects uh, work on them and see what they look like down here at the bottom is the timeline panel your different layers and effects will be shown here and uh, there is a uh, timeline that will actually show up in this area and you can scrub back and forth in it. Over here on this side is the uh, effects and presets panel. Ah, it froze. Oh, it's unfroze. And right here you can p find your different uh, effects. So if you type in something like blur, you can say here's the presets and then here's your actual effects. And then you can drag them onto your um, onto your different video footage or pictures and to create cool looking stuff. Um, here's the paragraph panel and the way you get to that is going to uh, window paragraph. If you click on it, it, it'll go away. Then you click on it again, which it shouldn't be enabled if you first started After Effects. So you click on it and then it'll appear. And a lot of the times if you're doing commercials, you're going to be writing text and it'll be in there. And uh, that is very helpful to have. I don't know why they don't have it on there to start with, but I would recommend putting it in over there. This is your preview panel, and uh, this is where you can um, do uh, what they call RAM previews, or you can just do regular previews, and it'll show you uh, your video footage in uh, in order so you can see how your effects are going to play out and ma make sure you can get your timing and animation uh, uh, looking nice. Up here is the info audio panel. And um, pretty much I never use this unless I need to find like a color or coordinates or something like that. And uh, mostly if I'm doing audio, I do it in a different program. But you can also do it in After Effects and it's not that bad to do it. But um, I just basically don't use this whole section a lot. <laughs> Up here is the tools uh, panel. You have um, different things like zooming and rotating and you can uh, select your text from here. Most of the time, when you uh, get good, you're going to not really use this too much. Uh, you're going to want to use your hotkeys because that speeds up your work way faster. Um, so that's just a basic uh, overview of the um, of the area of the screen. Just wanted to introduce myself. Um, again, it's Buddy Blackford. I'm doing the After Effects videos for uh, the new Boston for a while. And um, I hopefully I'll be doing some other ones too. So I hope you guys continue to watch and check out my next video. See ya.